guys so happy vlogmas today is day whatever i don't know what day it is but i'm sitting here with the little rugrats i'm sitting here with this little rugrat Jalen is here at the NICU because he was not feeling good so now we're here so i came up here to watch them and spend some time with them um so only shot is here. It's just me, shot, and Jalen. He doesn't want to be on camera right now, which is fine. He look a hot mess. Because he looks a hot mess, he said. <laughs> he doesn't look a mess, but I get it. Because I wouldn't want to be shown either. I think Lily's on her way here, but today's like a crazy day. We'll talk more about it later, but it's already been like insane. Shaw is sick. Really. Listen, everyone is sick right now. And the only thing that got better was my throat. Your throat? How do you feel, Jay? Um, Itchy. You feel itchy still? Oh, you was at school? Where was you at? I was at home. I think oh. he took an Uber to get home. So everyone's sick. Rashad, are you still sick or are you was sick? The only person who's not sick is Aaliyah's not sick anymore. That's a last week thing. That's what? A last week thing. A last week thing. Oh. Nan is sick. My mom is sick right now. I'm Pop up. Sick, but I have allergic reaction. Yeah, Jalen's not sick. He was having an allergic reaction, but it was like really, really bad. So he had to come to the hospital because it was really bad. At this point, we just gotta pray because even like one of my family members has experienced a death in their family today. And it's like, it's sad, like what's going on? Like, so I'm just here spending some time with fam. And I guess I'm gonna be just vlogging my day in the hospital, I guess. I didn't plan to do that because we didn't know that we was all going to end up in the hospital. But, you know, this is how life goes. And you just got to adapt to your surroundings and your circumstances and do what's best for you. So I got, I got um, Baconator fries and it ain't turn up the bacon. Let me see. Where are these fries from? Wendy's. Wendy's? Not they didn't cut up the bacon. How... You order Baconator fries and they literally give you a strip of bacon. That is crazy. That's what they always do on Wendy's. They're not, they're the supposed to, it's supposed to be chopped up fries. Like what? I want the smell good stuff. That's you want the what? That's why want McDonald's is better. You want the smell good stuff? I want the smoke with them. You want to smoke with them? <laughs> Wait, what? Do you want to smoke with them? Like when you bite? Oh! <laughs> Yo! <laughs> Jalen, I thought you were saying you want to smoke. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Did y'all hear that? I literally swear to god, I thought he said he wants to smoke. <laughs> I was about to go crazy. Like <laughs> he said he wants smoke with Wendy's. Like he wanna fight. Okay, that makes sense. Cause I was like, what? So I bought the kids some snacks. So we got goldfish, pop tart, pop tart, pop tart. Pop-Tart, anybody want a Pop-Tart? Damn. Nobody want it. Sour straws, sour straws, sour straws. Sour straws. I have Starburst Swirlers. But it's like a whole bunch of them, so. Oh, and what are the people from three years ago in the, the creating the Christmas tree video when we went ice skating? Say that again? Were the people from three years ago when we were decorating the Christmas tree and when we went ice skating? Where are they? No, we were the people from three oh, years ago. Oh, you know they know that, right? They do know <laughs> that. They know that you're the person from three years ago. It's not like you talk about us every year. But I do talk about y'all. Do you even watch my vlogs? <laughs> no. <laughs> exactly, like what? All right, look, I got Crunch Berry Crunch Bar. Disgusting. That's nasty? Yeah. It does. Do you want this, Jay? These are all your snacks anyway. Are these bad snacks? No. Sorry. <laughs> I asked him, was it bad snacks? He said it's all right. All right, let me see what else I got in here. These things are harder than usual. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. They don't know what these are. <gasps> okay. These are Maybe candies. Maybe because we're not 90s kids. You're right. You're absolutely right. That's exactly why. These are Razzles. Razzles. Actually, I think these came out in like the 80s. 
But Razzles are, they're like candy. You're a boomer. I am not a boomer. <laughs> Sorry, boo. <laughs> I'm Generation Z, or whatever the hell it's called. <laughs> <laughs> Did he just call me a boomer? <laughs> you was just born. So, I don't even know how you talking right yeah, now. Yeah, I was just born, um, what's it called? Five years ago. Wait. No. So you're five? <laughs> no. Nine years ago. You see? This is, what, <laughs> this, is, this is what happens when it's Generation Z and Generation Y. They don't, they don't understand. They don't get it. At least, yeah. we, can hit, <laughs> at least we can hit the gritty. But who wants to hit the gritty though? Everyone. You can't hit the chicken noodle soup. That's because you don't got any chicken noodle soup. <laughs> Jalen, you know how to hit the chicken noodle soup? No. You know how to hit the gritty? She, this is what I'm saying. She's a boomer. So hit the gritty. Let's see. And I know it's going to be busted. Oh my God. I don't know what I can't that do was. Right now. No, don't say you can't do it right now. You can't do it at all. It's because I forgot, dude. No, I need a school. You forgot? Yeah. So then you're the boomer. Because only boomers forget things. Razzles, this is candy that turns into gum. That's the gritty? Please, okay? Please. Uh, you the chicken little soup. No, I don't have to prove myself to you. <laughs> when, people, when people don't want to do something, that's what they say. I don't have to prove myself to you. Alright guys, welcome back to my new channel. This is what I used to do three years ago. Let me teach That was so random. Teach me how to do the gritty. Wait, hold on. Let me send this text real quick. You want to jump on like this on your feet? How you do it? You want to jump on your foot like this? So do that first. And then put your hand like this while jumping forward. <laughs> like that? Um, like every three seconds you would do this and then put your hands down. <laughs> I feel like a damn elf. A doctor was looking at you. <laughs> no. <laughs> Guys, this is exactly why I said she's a boomer. First off, I can't wait till you become a boomer. Because guess what? You gonna be old and wrinkly. How am I a boomer if I'm 28? That's still old. How is that old? You know, after you get out of high school, you turn 20. No. You're 18, 19, 20, and then what? How is that a boomer? It's still old. How? Auntie's wearing her own merch to make herself feel relevant. First off, this is merch that's not even released, so how about you sit down, Generation Y? Oh, can I get a new sweater? I don't even that's, have I'm, any more. I'm leaking her merch. I don't have any more of this I'm merch. I'm leaking it. I don't so, have any more. This is what happens to when you're on to YouTube you get free merch. This is what happens when what? Free clothes, guys. When you're on to YouTube you get free clothes. Um, you was just calling me a boomer, so. Exactly. <laughs> Yo, you're out of control. Guys, I'm getting hired to be her editor. I'm showing you guys the unreal I'm showing you guys the footage. How do you, you don't even know how to work the camera. Ow. So you don't know how to do the gritty and you don't know how to work the yes, camera. Yes, I do know how to do the gritty. <laughs> do it again. <laughs> Yo, he just tried to do it and he slipped. I said, there's no way that's the gritty. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> I don't know what that is. <laughs> that's the gritty. That ain't no gritty. That's what that I is. I can do the McRiddle. Go ahead. That's the yeah. That's that is the McRiddle. <laughs> no, I'm not doing it. It's an unreleased dance. A unreleased dance. Goodbye. Mickey Mouse. No, no, no my computer freezing. <laughs> See, this is exactly why you're a boomer. Why am I a boomer? <laughs> because your computer friend. Look, so I'm a boomer because my cam my computer froze. Yeah, because you got a really old computer. Do you have one? Yeah. No, you don't. <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> it's, your just, computer it's just a really old one. So you're a boomer. <laughs> no, I'm not. 
Guys, whose wallpaper is better? Yeah, Mine or my aunt's? We about to play Connect Four. I'm actually supposed to be vlogging right now. <laughs> I mean, not vlogging, editing my vlogs right now. But honestly, like, I'd rather just spend time with the 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 Generation Y kids because I'm gonna be a little in Connect Four because my nickname. No, do you remember my nickname, Rashad? Wait, hold on. Do you remember my nickname? No. Yellow? No. You don't know that name? No one used to call you that. Everybody calls me that. No one used to call you that. Everybody calls this me that. Exactly you don't know the um, You're a boomer. You don't know the this hood exactly princess, Yellow. <laughs> you don't know who that is, so. Alright, you wasn't even born. Right, I'm telling you, she's a boomer. I'm canceling you. <laughs> Here we go canceling stuff. Everybody always goes here first. <laughs> You don't want to play tennis? I just randomly go there. I don't know why. You wait for your pool? Wait, you got to see me okay. too. I got to know I'm cute on camera. Why does everybody go there first? If I win this, you guys all got to subscribe to my channel. Don't subscribe. <laughs> I'm playing defense right now, y'all. Well, I didn't mean to go there. That You can't even do that, but I'm going to let you do it. I'm, tra I'm but this trying is, to go This there. is illegal. This I, is literally illegal. I guess I'm going to jail then. You might go to uh, Connect for jail. <laughs> I'm not letting you get that spot. I'm not letting. I'm not even doing that though. You told me about that just now. <laughs> what? <laughs> I think gaming mode initiated. I'm going serious now. Now he want to be serious because you know I'm about the. I'm about to get. They call him. me Shad the Uno Pro. I'm about to get you. I'm shot the Uno Pro because I'm about to win though. Okay, so win. <laughs> win right now. I'm shooting around. <laughs> what was that? I feel like you're just following me. <laughs> what are you doing, Auntie? What are you doing? Mind your business. You, you know, like the kids is always in my business. You're a clown. And you think you're gonna beat me. <laughs> That's the craziest part. You're a clown and your channel is a circus. Boo. <laughs> you tell a funny joke on your channel? <laughs> I tell funny jokes all the time. Do you watch? This is the second time asking. Do you watch my videos? No. Uh, yeah. No. Uh, yeah. He's exposing himself. <laughs> Go. Do you watch my videos? Yes, I do, actually. Me? Yes, I do. <laughs> Mm -mm. I do watch your videos. I watch when you, you put the guy on fire. So Sean makes stop motion videos <laughs> and mold. <laughs> All right. All right. This epic gaming for you. Real for you. Huh? What you say? Epic gaming for you for you. I have four pieces left. Yeah, you got to lose. One, two, three, four, Auntie. Hmm, what are you doing here, Auntie? What are you doing here? I won! <laughs> what? I'm going to leave you on the end. You guys, my nephew is such a hater. I literally I'm won. Not a hater. I literally look. You coughing everywhere. I literally won, and he let it all go. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Guys, y'all seen him? I have proof she's lying. How? Where's the proof? I got the proof. It's all on my phone. Your phone was right here the whole time. Please. Oh. And look what he made me set my phone cover as. <laughs> this is mine. I, I have mine as this. This is my lock screen. He made me do this like a week ago. This is him. He took this when he was next to me and he said, put it as your cover now. And he put a knife to my head. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see yours. This, this is mine. This is my lock screen. What the heck? <laughs> just... All right, and this is my home screen. <laughs> this is what you call insane. <laughs> My home screen is yeah. this. Still dizzy? My home screen easily beats yeah. her home screen. My home screen wins. It's better. No, it's not. I'm actually supposed to be editing right now. Like, and I was supposed to get on a call today with um, L'Oreal, but I missed it because it was so much stuff going on. You guys, I was supposed to get on a call today, 
I was supposed to go get a tattoo today. I know my lace might look a mess, but that, that is she, not crazy. She on purpose skipped all of this to, just to do vlogmas with me. Exactly. Skipped it on purpose. I did. She really doesn't want to do any of it. <laughs> vlogmas? Yeah. Yes, I do want to do vlogmas. No, you want to do vlogmas. You don't want to do any of the other things. How do you know that? Because I know. This boy think he know me, and he dead don't. Yes, I do. No, you don't. You was just born like nine years ago. Oh, you know how to play? Yeah, not really, actually. I know how to play checkers, though. Let me show them this book. You guys, they have a book. You see, a menace to society. <laughs> I'm trying to show y'all the book, and he takes the book. Now, if I take off my belt, then what? You have all the evidence on camera that you use. What camera? <laughs> on this camera. There is a, no. I'm, I'm gonna turn it off. <laughs> I'm gonna turn the camera you're off. Turn it off if I take it. You can't take it because your camera is faster than me. Yes, I can. I'm an athlete. How much you want to bet? I'm a pro athlete. <laughs> he said he's a pro athlete. I said I'm a pro athlete. A pro athlete. <laughs> yeah. This boy just makes himself laugh at this point. So I'm finally home, you guys. I'm tired. I got my mask on still because I was at the hospital and I'm around my mom. But we got Ginger, Dee and Bad. Give me that. Now I got the, the dish rag. Come here. And then I'm trying to get. The, come here. Give it to me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's so nice. Don't come over here and attack me now. My mom is making some steak she's making. I Why is this girl still attacking me? So I'm finally home. It's 5.50 and I haven't even posted vlogmas or edit it vlogmas it's just gonna have to go up late it's fine you know it'll go up and it's all right because other stuff is important so um, my parmesan potatoes my mom makes these like parmesan potato things so i'm trying no, on this is her steak so i'm gonna try one Bone apple tea. They taste better than last time. What you do? Use the real parmesan. I didn't use the um. Whatever parmesan you used last time, you used yeah. that last time. No. Okay. Why? It tastes better. I like these onions. The onions on it, right? Yeah. yeah. One thing about me, I don't do onions. I will never do onions. I don't care how old I get. Onions are not my thing. But I mean, scallions actually. Oh, okay. Scallions. Scallion onions. They're good. On the potato, right? And I really don't like onions. I could almost not like this, but I like it. I don't like the um like the strong aftertaste. No. Like the reason why I don't like onions is because they're too strong. I also don't like cilantro. Cilantro is really strong. I actually can't take I if somebody makes a meal with cilantro, they could grind up the cilantro all they want. I you cannot don't have see, to it. see it. I don't have to see it to know that it's there. As soon as I, like I, my taste buds are very sensitive. Like I can taste it. You don't like cilantro? I hate cilantro with a passion. Like it mm. ruins it ruins the entire meal. Mm. You crazy? That's crazy. Yes. Move, Ginger. So you don't like Mexican food then? I do like Mexican food. I just don't like the cilantro on it. Why did you have So I always have them take the cilantro off of like my tacos. Um, I get this sandwich from Panera Bread. It's like this chicken sandwich. I forget what it's called. But they always put cilantro on it. Well, it comes with cilantro on it and I always have them take it off. And I just can't do it. Me, I'm cutting this. Move! She's sitting under my seat, looking for food. Yeah, she's waiting for it to drop. And she'll lick, lick the shit out of your hands. 
I'm just cutting it anyway. I don't care. You made a salad? No. I never made a steak before. I never cooked steak. Those are good though. Don't ever use this oh, other yeah, cheese because that cheese talk. actually like, it t took the taste, the idea of what it was supposed to be away, you know? So I get ruined it. But that's good. I'm exhausted. It is about 9.15 p.m. Um, I just finished editing Vlogmas. I was so late with just everything today. I was been supposed to have today's video edited like days ago. But, you know, Vlogmas gets hard. This is why I used to quit because it gets hard. Things come up like it's so weird. It is really weird. Like everyone in my family is sick right now. My nephew's in the hospital. My other nephew had pneumonia. The one that you guys uh, seen being funny. He had pneumonia like a day ago. He was also in the hospital last week. A family member of a family member died and a lot going on. Like my sister, she had to go run important errands. So I had to go and be with my nephews and not even just babysit them but i had to be there for them you know so things just been like a little rough my mom and my dad were sick that was really rough on me um i was really emotional for the last few days i don't know you guys probably can't really tell like that in the last few videos i was really emotional because i just can't imagine what my life would be like without my family like my sister actually is getting over a cold and her daughter. So literally everyone is sick except for me. So um, I was really emotional, like super duper emotional. And um, I guess it kind of made me feel like I almost had like some type of guilt because it's like, I'm just out here with a damn camera in my hand while my parents are battling covid at home and i'm just out but i mean i have to go out because i can't even be around them anyway and then i have to vlog you know like so it's no point in me sitting in the house anyway i'm probably gonna get sick if i just sit in the house around them so i might as well go out and then it's, i don't know i just felt like shit you know like i really don't know what i would do without my family Every, the beat the fact that everyone is sick and then like my nephew he had to be in a NICU because it was so bad. It was just, it's just like, I don't know. Like I get to these points where, I don't know, I was really emotional for the past few days though. Like I don't, I really don't know what I would do without my family. Like, and I'm not, I don't wanna get emotional right now. So I'm gonna stop talking about this. Um, but December feels like a hard month. Like, I don't know. Uh, I had a friend that passed last December. My dog passed last December. And then I guess this December, everyone is just like getting sick. And, you know, I just got to stay positive and keep praying that everyone's going to be okay. Um, they moved my nephew down to a different section of the hospital. So that means that he's getting better. So I'm just hoping that he can, you know, go back home tomorrow because he does not want to be there. Uh, he really doesn't. So... Um, tomorrow I'm probably gonna bring him some snacks and some sushi. He loves sushi. He loves seafood. He loves crab legs He keeps asking for crab legs. I'm not bringing no damn crab legs to the hospital But he has like all the doctors knowing that he wants crab legs like <laughs> Like I can't I really can't so but I'm gonna bring him some sushi I'm gonna bring him a California roll and then I told him about the shrimp tempura roll um, he loves to eat. He love, love, loves to eat. He actually wants to be a chef. So I told him um, if he does get in high school, then I'll open him a restaurant. So I'm probably going to do that tomorrow because tomorrow I have a meeting with Tatcha. So fun. I'm excited about that. And I have a meeting with Tatcha at 5. So, um... I'm gonna go to the city at five. Yeah, I'm just, 
um i'm i'm trying not to get overwhelmed i feel like a lot of my vlogs are me just giving rants on things that i've learned in the past year and i guess this is almost like a yearly reflection because i don't know i'm just so different like and i hate to even say that myself like saying that myself almost feels like yeah whatever bitch you know but i just feel different like i just feel like a different person like i don't know i just feel like i don't know i just feel like i'm just like a wiser person i mean i am 28 i should be you know this is the stage i should be at in life um so i just i don't know i just feel like i used to get really overwhelmed about literally everything especially during december december is always like a crazy month and so i think me i didn't know how to deal with me being overwhelmed like i would get really overwhelmed and just kind of like get annoyed and stressed out and whatever this this and that and so i'm learning how to deal with being overwhelmed because it doesn't have to be all of that you know as long as everyone's okay right now and the world's not falling apart, we're good. We are okay. So I've been learning to tell myself that for the last year. Like, it's going to be okay. Like, it doesn't have to be this big of an issue or this dramatic. And I think I'm very dramatic. I don't know. I might be. I might be a little dramatic. But... I feel like, you know, sometimes I could take things like super crazy or take things super personal and it just becomes this huge thing for me. And that's the part where I get overwhelmed. So for the past year, I've just been learning to be like, you know, it doesn't have to be all of that. You know, it doesn't have to be that large of an issue. It This is small things to a giant. And I am the giant. I'm the giant here. And I have to always remember that. And I know this sounds like so like, oh my God, shut the fuck up. You're boring. But seriously, like, I'm the motherfucking giant. The biggest. <laughs> Big Leah, not the little one. <laughs> I can't. Um, You would never hear me say that ever again. <laughs> I don't say shit like that. But dead ass though. You know, things don't have to be as bad as it may feel. It may feel bad. But is it really bad? So, yes, today was stressful. Because one thing about me, I have a savior complex. I think that's what it's called. I don't know. A hero complex. I do have that. Yes, I do. And I'm going to admit it right now and right here. And maybe I could do like a in-depth video about this because I definitely have a hero complex. And I think last year I had to really admit that to myself and tell myself that I can't save everybody. And my mom actually just told me that too today because I was telling her like, you know, how sad I was and how this, you know made me feel crazy um and she's like i'm okay like you can't save me god can only save me you know her but i do have a hero complex where i feel like i can almost save everyone so i'm a cancer i am the mother sign of the zodiac and i mother everyone and that's just really me like in real life like i'm like I want to be everyone's like comfortable and safe place and I want to make sure everyone's good and everyone's safe and everyone's fine. If you have an issue, I'm going to figure it out. I'm going to do my best that I can do to figure it out. This this situation is not going to go unsolved, especially if I'm in your life. That's me. And it's not fun. I don't like it because I take on more responsibility than I should or that I have to because nobody is my responsibility besides me and yes this you know I'm and I'm just saying that just in general like I take on issues that are not even issues that's what I'm saying I make issues out of issues no wait time out I make issues out of no issues and it becomes an issue but 
yeah, I don't want to be a hero anymore. I don't want to be an empath anymore. I don't want to be a fucking cancer. I want to be a normal person <laughs> because this is not normal. Like the feelings and the emotions, I can't take it. I've been saving myself today. I'm gonna take a shower. I ordered some food and I can't eat my food at dinner if I don't shower. I don't know. So I'm gonna take a shower and I'm gonna clean up a little bit. I just got out the shower. I need a goddamn brush. It looks a mess, okay? Let me just put it back in the bonnet. <laughs> well, I'm about to edit tomorrow's video. Fuck that. So, I was gonna do an unboxing, but I think I might save that for the next video because... Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this Vlogmas. I hope you are enjoying Vlogmas. Let me just say, Vlogmas is never easy to do. So, if you are here watching, thank you so much for your support. I really appreciate it because... As you guys know, it's not easy. And this is my life. I hope you guys enjoying it. It's not perfect. It's not glittery. It never was. And I'm good with that. Okay. I'll see you guys later. Bye guys. <laughs>